Hi all, I'm Niputu Maswandewi from Indonesia, from Bali. So my project is about Megat by conversion in neighborhood scale with technology and to tackle the food waste issue. The Generation Connect Young Leadership Programme is, as the name probably suggests, about connections and leadership. Launched last year by the UN's International Telecommunication Union and by Huawei, 30 fellowships were awarded to young people, giving them the chance to turn their creative, digital, community-driven ideas into practical reality. And since they come from all four corners of the globe, that's pretty good news for the rest of us. Health, education, agriculture, governance, all of these are projects and solutions in the making. And frankly, the United Nations of the world could certainly do with a few of those. Well, we're here in Geneva this week for the inaugural boot camp of the program. And we're gonna be featuring six of those projects, showing off a range of the regional innovations on offer. And third up in our series is Swan from Indonesia. So basically, uh, my project is about Black Solder Fi or Megat Bioconversion, where we try to tackle the food waste issue in the world, especially in Indonesia. So we, uh, using the Megat, we try to convert from food waste into biomass and feed it to the livestock like chicken, fish, and also we have fertilizer we can use for plantations. So it's maggots breaking maggot. down food waste mm -hmm. and then effectively recycling yeah. that for animal feed and, yeah. and other use. A food waste is not just a simple thing, it's a word issue where uh, maybe we just feel like uh, oh, we throw away our food but not feeling guilty anymore. That's why I'm trying to figure out what kind of thing or activities that I can do to contribute as a young leader or as a change maker. Yeah, so there's, and there is a lot of food waste. Mm -hmm. I don't know if Indonesia is the same as my yeah. country, the United Kingdom, a lot of food is just chucked out yeah, and you're yeah. saying we can use this mm -hmm. there is a, a better purpose mm -hmm. for it a better usage mm -hmm. uh, the my gut thing or my gut by conversion it actually already implemented in some area in indonesia mm -hmm. but they just do it uh, for small scale and also big scales but not really uh, utilize technology to right. uh, during the process so that's why i come up with this solution so we can implement this my gut by conversion in all neighborhood area in indonesia so the first uh, the food waste will be collected into one place and then the food waste we can use to substrate for the my gut uh, breeding process mm -hmm. and then when the larva is ready to be harvested we give to the chicken and fish that kind of uh, smart farming i designed it mm -hmm. where with IoT and anything so we can monitor the uh, process mm -hmm. and we also have fertilizer when we can use for plantation we can get fruit vegetables and all of this we can sell and get money the money can we use for people that uh, maybe cause oppression uh, to develop the neighborhood area that and so what can the ITU and Huawei what can we do to help overcome some of the technological challenges that you might face in this project? So far, maybe I um, study software engineering. I learned about user persona, how to develop application for people. But um, if I can work with Huawei and ITU, where I really can learn from this kind of expertise, people that really work, uh, make some policy or how I can approach people in neighborhood skill. So, Maybe Huawei will uh, help me more about the technical skill, how can I develop the uh, IoT things and also the application. And ITU will help me how to approach my government so the government will um, accept my idea so I can implement its, this idea in all areas of Indonesia or maybe in the world. So it's that collaboration and yeah, that collaboration. sort of... Um, onto a bigger mm -hmm, footing, mm -hmm. a bigger setting. And just finally then, in five years from now, in 10 years from now, what is the, the dream outcome for you for this project? My dream is from this project, 
for now actually 73% of food waste in Indonesia is en ending up in landfill area. So I wish in the future there's no food waste again in uh, landfill or maybe another waste also can be recycling. We have that kind of knowledge. We also have a lot of NGO that already um, took like activities or trying to make their contribution, but I really need a government, NGO, and society work together. Collaboration is more important than competition. So that's why we have to collaborate each other, young people, um, and uh, the other people that have more expertise than us, experience, and young people have more technology skill or something. So we can collaborate each other, we can implement this kind of thing, so there's no um, like waste again in the landfill and we can also have um, livestock that we can uh, deliver it for people or uh, all in area in Indonesia because the stunting rate in Indonesia is also quite high so I also said about that things there's a lot of food waste but the stunting rate is quite high so I want to tackle these two kinds of issue.